They drive. Do they drive fast? Yes. Fans like this one, young and old, will flock to Faroat Park Saturday morning and afternoon for the annual Lima Soapbox Derby, an event that's gotten bigger each of the last few years. We got more than what we had last year. This year, uh, we got, we're sitting at 48 cars, 22 uh, stock cars, 20 super stock cars, and six master cars. I'm really excited. It's going to be my fifth year, so I'm really hoping that it'll turn out good. It's great family fun here. Uh, that's what it's all about is bonding with your kids. The friends, the competition, it's all just, the Soapbox Derby is a great experience and I just, I can't wait. Sisters Brooklyn and Riley Imes have practice runs against one another and other friends to prepare for Saturday. We actually raced down a hill in Bluffton. Um, Claire Oatman, she's a first year racer. We raced with her too. It's a lot of fun. It's just and Taylor Miller will bump up a division after winning the Lima race last year and finishing fourth at the World Championships in Akron last summer. We just did a whole bunch of awesome things throughout the week. They made it um, really fun for us. Oh, that was just amazing. Uh, fourth place, All-American champ. I mean, that's worldwide. It's just great to, for her to bring that back to Lima. Uh, it was amazing. I had a blast. Like, it was an unbelievable, unbelievable experience. More memories will be made Saturday at Faroat Park, and you can see many of the races Saturday night at 10 on WOSN.